Hi everyone, my name is Steph, this is Little Bookish Teacher, and today I'm here to talk to you about two new release books from Alan and Unwin. We have Wolf Girl 9 and We Didn't Think It Through by Gary Lonsbro. So these were both sent to me unsolicited from Alan and Unwin, so thank you very much to them for the review copies, and we're just going to talk really briefly about them. So Wolf Girl is an ongoing series by Ando. This is book nine in the series, it's called Single Swim, and it is an ongoing serial middle grade story. It is an adventure story about Gwen and her pack of dogs and a magical wolf who are caught in a world where there is a government that has overtaken everything, kidnapped Gwen's parents and many other people and is taking over the world. And Gwen and her pack are trying to outrun them and outwit them. Every book ends on a cliffhanger and each book starts in the middle of that scene. So in this one we start when Gwen and her pack are in the middle of a race across a river. They're being pursued by helicopters and things are pretty tense. They end up coming across a village that is caught in a massive storm and they end up helping out in the village and then things go from bad to worse. And so Gwen and her pack find themselves agreeing to help out this village and to try and free the villagers who have been taken prisoner. There is a very big reveal at the end of this book, again cliffhanger ending, and it's a reveal that I think will surprise many people. So this one is very fast-paced, very action-packed. It is written in the same style as all the other books, so you move through it really quickly. This is a really popular series and it's easy to see why. The cliffhangers are a great hook because it means you want to pick up the next one and you have to pick up the next one to find out what's going to happen next. But I think the thing that I enjoy most is the banter between these characters, particularly the dogs, who are just utterly delightful and they just add so much levity to quite a tense middle grade title. And then We Didn't Think It Through by Gary Lonsborough is tense but for completely different reasons. This is a young adult title by an Indigenous author following an indigenous teen. Jamie lives in a town called Dalton Bay. He lives with his auntie and his uncle. He has been taken from his parents, so there is a very strong undercurrent of that part of indigenous history woven through this story and the impact that that has on indigenous kids. And one night Jamie and his friends go out to take revenge on someone who has been bullying them. And it goes horribly wrong and Jamie finds himself suddenly in the justice system. And the way that the justice system just characterizes kids as dangers to society when perhaps there is more to the story than that. And it is a very hard read. It is incredibly well written. It's incredibly worth reading and was just a book I was not expecting and I'm very grateful to have read. I think it opens up a lot of questions, particularly if you've never found yourself in the same situation as Jamie. It's very hard to understand what it means to go through something like that. And this book is simply a glimpse. It is thought provoking and will hopefully open up lots of conversations, but it is also a very clear indication that the justice system, there are many, many things wrong with it. So very, very powerful book very grateful to have read it so thank you very much to the publisher for sending it through to me. I will leave links to where you can find out more information about both these books down below in the comments. I would love to know if you have read either of them or if you're planning on picking them up. They've only just come out uh, at the start of July. I will be reading Gary Lonsborough's other young adult title The Boy from the Mish in a couple of months time for a project so I'm looking forward to getting back to that because I really enjoyed Gary's writing style. I hope that wherever you are in the world you're doing well and staying safe and I will see you in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye everyone.